pretty gloomy out there. Yeah, still trying to work out some of that cloud coverage across northwest Arkansas. We're actually going to take you back to the Bobby Hopper Tunnel. Right now you see that traffic still backed up there. This is going northbound again. Crews trying to clear up that accident. You can barely see traffic just now starting to move along. Hopefully they start to clear up that accident as people are trying to get home this evening. Taking a look at radar again. Heaviest portion of this system pushing out towards the east now. Still heavy rainfall across Carroll, Madison, Johnson, and Logan counties this evening. But folks who live across northwest Arkansas and Benton in Washington County and then in the River Valley across Crawford and Sebastian County starting to see those clouds start to clear out just a bit. A few more showers still trailing behind this system still in eastern Oklahoma could be working their wind way into five country later on this evening. Definitely lighter showers tracking of when we're going to see the system start to move out again. Light showers still expected throughout the rest of this evening. Definitely lighter than what we saw earlier on today. That should be clearing out by the time we get into Saturday afternoon and start to see more sunshine back into the forecast. So starting off tomorrow morning, still could see a few of those showers across northwest Arkansas and the River Valley, and then we head into a dry stretch of weather and temperatures warming back up into those 50s and 60s by the time we get later on into this upcoming work week. Taking a look at current temperatures across northwest Arkansas, still up into those 40s and 50s, even though we're past that rainfall now. 50 in Fayetteville right now, 49, 46 in Springdale, 48 in Rogers, and 48 in Bentonville. Across the River Valley got those 40s this evening, 48 in Clarksville and Boonville, 48 in Fort Smith and 46 in Alma. Now taking a look at the rest of the night tonight again temperature is going to be settling into those low 40s across northwest Arkansas. Showers still going to be available throughout the rest of the night tonight and heading into tomorrow morning across the River Valley. Showers also going to be available heading into the early morning hours. Very light showers are expected once we get into tomorrow morning. Temperatures should be starting off into those 40s by the time we get to the afternoon warming up into those 50s. So northwest Arkansas heading into tomorrow. Temperatures going to be starting off into those low 40s. Still cloud coverage going to be available across northwest Arkansas, breaking out that sunshine once we get into the afternoon into the evening and temperatures should be topping out close to 50 degrees across the river valley tomorrow. Temperatures starting off into those mid 40s, working our way into the afternoon, tapping out into those low 50s for our daytime highs. So for this weekend, starting off the weekend with maybe a few showers very early in the morning and then working our way into that sunshine for Sunday. Temperatures should be topping out into those mid 50s for the end of the weekend. Overall, though, as we get closer towards Christmas, above average temperatures are expected. Again, the rest of this upcoming work week, we're talking about temperatures warming back up into those high 50s and low 60s. Taking a look at our 10-day forecast, temperatures going to be warming back up as we go later on to this week. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, temperatures going to be back up close to 60 degrees across northwest Arkansas, and then we get into that next system that arrives just before Christmas Day. Now, right now, that next system just looks like it's going to be some rainfall, but it could carry all the way up until Christmas Day, so we'll be tracking that next system as we get a little bit closer. 10 days away, it's still going to change. Yes, 10 days away, still very far out, but just keeping our eye out of potentially oh, yeah. seeing some rain for a big travel day, obviously. If you're traveling early, though, lots of sunshine temperatures, way warm for this time of year. All right, I love it. Thanks, Stephen. Still ahead tonight on your five days at six. There are lots of